you know the market value of your property, and it differs significantly from the assessor's market value, you have the right to administrative and judicial review of your assessment. But before pursuing a formal assessment review, you should first meet with your assessor. Sometimes an informal talk is enough to resolve any differences. If a meeting does not resolve your situation, you can then pursue administrative review, often known as a grievance. For most communities, the Board of Assessment Review meets to hear grievances on the fourth Tuesday in May. But check with your assessor to confirm the date for your municipality. Most communities also require resident owners to file a grievance form, RP 524, on or before Grievance Day in order to be heard. It doesn't cost anything to grieve your assessment, and you don't need to hire a lawyer. In fact, if you live in New York City or Nassau County, you can even file your grievance application online. Visit the city or county website for more information. On Grievance Day, the board will consider your case. It's not usually necessary to appear in person, but it's not a bad idea to show up on Grievance Day anyway. This gives you the opportunity to make your case, hear what your assessor has to say, and answer any questions the board may have. Usually, the Board of Assessment Review will not make a decision on the day of the hearing. After the details of your case have been heard, the Board will deliberate privately to make a determination. Once a decision has been reached, a notice will be sent to you by mail detailing the Board's determination and the reasons for it. If you don't receive the adjustment you requested, you still have the option to pursue judicial review of your assessment. Most homeowners have the option of filing for a Small Claims Assessment Review, or SCAR for short. Those who aren't eligible for SCAR should consult with an attorney about a tax certiorari proceeding in State Supreme Court. To be eligible for a Small Claims Assessment Review, you must have already grieved your assessment and been denied the full amount of relief you requested. If you were awarded a partial adjustment, you can still proceed with SCAR to make your case for the balance. SCAR only costs $35 and you don't need to hire a lawyer. Your SCAR case will be heard by a court-appointed hearing officer, often a lawyer or a real estate professional. As with the Board of Assessment Review, you'll be notified by mail of the hearing officer's determination. One last thing to remember, assessors are only responsible for assessing the value of your property. They don't determine your taxes. You can't grieve your taxes, but if you think your taxes are too high, even though your assessment is fair, you should get involved with the budget process for your school district, your city, your town or county. The budgets that determine your taxes are debated publicly during meetings of the school board, city council, town board, or county legislature. These meetings are the appropriate form for addressing your concerns about taxes. To learn more about contesting an assessment, just go to our website, where you can find information on a variety of real property tax topics, as well as a link to the Office of Court Administration for information on small claims assessment review. Visit us today at www.tax.ny.gov.